In tonight's crime report, a robbery was reported that on September 1st, a shop in the vicinity of the Seventh-day Adventist Church was robbed by two men with handguns. Provo police arrived on the scene and spoke with the shop owner, who said two masked men wearing dark clothing ran into the shop. One demanded money while the other searched for cash. The bandits got away with about $100 in cash. This is under investigation. Also on September 1st, there are reports that the Five Keys fish plant was burglarized. Provo police arrived on the scene. The complainant pointed out to officers a window on the front of his dwelling house and stated that he was out and when he returned, he noticed the window broken and it was discovered that a laptop computer and a Bose two-way speaker was missing. Provo police are investigating. Now, it was yesterday when a man of Q-Town contacted the police station and made a report that someone had broken into his home and requested police assistance. The man told police that he was awakened by a noise and when he made checks, he saw a western window in the kitchen was opened. He noticed a refrigerator and a stove was missing. He further stated that he continued to look around when he noticed a man inside. He held on to the man until the police showed up. The suspect was arrested and taken into police custody. Also yesterday, a Blue Hills resident contacted the police station and made a report that he saw a man lying on the ground in the area of Beaches Resort on the Lower Bite Road. The police arrived on the scene and met the ambulance there. The officer saw a Haitian male with bruises about his body. He stated that he was assaulted with a cutlass by another Haitian man whom he knows. The injured man was taken to the Cheshire Hall Medical Center for medical treatment. Further investigations are to be carried out by Provo Police.